Hi, my name's Clem Sturgis. So I'm here today on behalf of Online Flooring to have a chat to you about the Aquaplank product, which is a, a laminator. It represents the, the latest generation of laminate flooring that features a highly moisture resistant core um, and is a much further development of the original laminate category. So the next product I want to discuss is the Aquaplank laminate flooring. Laminate has got an undeservedly bad rap over the years, um, mostly because when the product category first came out, it was quality product made in Europe over top of a waterproof membrane. And what happened is the product started to be made in um, markets like China, the quality of the product dropped and we started using a membrane that wasn't waterproof over top of new slabs. Um, that caused a lot of water ingress into the product. So with early laminates, there was a, um, there was a bit of hesitation with people putting them down after a while because there was a bit of failure. The category to survive has had to evolve and, and it's certainly done that now. Our Aquaplank is a product that can be wet mopped, steam mopped, put into wet areas. Um, it's conquered the, pro or the problems that laminate had in the past with moisture ingress. The product can be installed now in rafts that are 20 metres by 20 metres without having to break the floor or transition the floor internally. What that means is that most houses don't require internal expansion gaps now as older products used to. The, the thing that the laminate has over the hybrid and the LVT or the, the vinyl plank category is the wear layer. It's far more scratch resistant, stain resistant and burn resistant than a vinyl plank or a hybrid flooring. The, um, the test shows sanding discs, cigarettes, stains, all of that doesn't affect this where it does affect the other stuff with the, with the vinyl plank surface to it. The other thing that Laminate has is it's um, many years ahead of both vinyl plank and hybrid in its development. So they've learnt from the mistakes that we're still learning about in other categories. So in, in the case of Laminate, you've got that that better wear layer. It can do pretty much everything a hybrid can, but you can get much bigger boards, you get better quality pictures in the print, and typically the surface detail is more realistic on a laminate as well. And things like a, a registered embossed surface where your, your wear layer and your picture film match each other, whereas in a lot of vinyl plank and hybrid flooring they don't. So when the light hits them, they can look a little bit like they're plastic. Um, with this, you get a far more realistic uh, surface detail to it and a far more realistic look at the end of the job. Um, again a 20 by 20 raft, it's, we can't call it waterproof because it does have a wood core to it, however the difference is like splitting hairs. Um, it can do everything almost that a hybrid can do but it can do many many things that a hybrid can't. The thing with the laminate would be that you are lifting the floor height by a bit more, in this case you've got a 12 mil product that sits on 2 mil of underlay so you've got a 14 mil rise in the floor. Um, but if you can deal with that, it's personally my favorite product and what I put into my own home. So in conclusion, um, if you want something that's <coughs> gonna be scratch resistant, stain resistant, burn resistant, and incredibly moisture resistant, to me, laminate flooring, or in particular, the, the new generation of laminate flooring, which Aquaplank is, is sort of at the forefront of, um, that's, that's really, if you've got like a, a family that has kids and dogs and they're inside, um, it's a floor that you can actually live on without having to treat it with kid gloves. Um, other floor coverings do require probably a larger degree of, of care and um, thought when you're, when you're on them, whereas with the Aquaplank, it tends to be far more fire and forget. You put it down and you just live on the product.